And outside, it's beautiful, but definitely cold and brisky, starting to feel like a crisp, crisp, Thanksgiving holiday ahead. Yeah, and it's absolutely going to get colder as we head through the night tonight. That's really the main focus of the forecast tonight. Before we dive into that forecast, I do want to talk about a little earthquake we had just to the south of Arvin. So if you did feel some rumbles earlier here late this afternoon, uh, you're not alone. But if you didn't feel them, not that surprising. Only a 2.8 magnitude there south of Arvin. As far as our weather, though, again, the big story, it's going to be getting very cold tonight. And you can see clear skies, not just for us in Kern County, all across California, big area of high pressure is building in. That's going to keep our skies clear for several nights. That's going to mean some very cold overnight temperatures. Even here in Bakersfield, we're going to get close to freezing. I don't think we're going to get there, but it's going to be close. 35 here in Bakersfield, places like Delano down to about 30 degrees. So frost definitely possible in the valley and really all across Kern County tonight. It is going to be quite cold. Temperatures, though, returning back to normal for tomorrow. 50s and 60s in the desert, which is still a little cool for this time of year. 62 right at average for us here in Bakersfield tomorrow. Winds not that strong in the valley. Still a little bit of a breeze through the mountains. Not too bad in the desert. Just the occasional spotty wind gust possible tomorrow. Air quality not too bad in the moderate range. No burning unless registered for tomorrow. Let's take a look at the seven day forecast because the cold temperatures we see tonight are not isolated. They're going to be with us for a while with those clear skies all the way through about Sunday night. We're looking at temperatures in a pretty similar range, so staying pretty cool. The overnight uh, lows, though, not indicative of the temperatures for the daytime, though. Those are still pretty close to normal into the lower 60s here. First day of December coming up pretty soon, and we do see those overnight lows get a little bit warmer towards the end of the forecast. Again, still a little bit breezy in the mountains for tomorrow. Not as bad as they were today. Cold over night for pretty much everyone in Kern County for the next several days. We do see another system moving in next week. Doesn't look like it's going to bring us any rain here, but the potential for some more uh, breezy winds as we head into Wednesday for our desert communities, potentially in the valley as well. But uh, again, the big story, you're going to have to bundle up if you're going to be out early tomorrow morning. If you got any shopping plans, it is definitely going to be getting cold with many of us dropping well into the 30s. Woo. Wow, that's yeah, that's the correct reaction. Getting, getting chills just thinking about it, Brandon. 